A local business owner is retiring after an attack that left her hospitalized. Reporter Zach Moran Norris sat down with the victim and shares her story. But we want to warn you, some of the images may be graphic. The 89-year-old stepping away from her business after she was brutally attacked right here in her own shop. Rose Roberson has sewn a lot of stitches in her 30 years at her alteration shop. I'm just ready to quit, you know, I'm just ready to quit. It's been a long time. At 89 years old, she's ready to retire. Not because she wants to, but because of a traumatic attack that left her handicapped. After all these years, and then something like that happened. It's really sad, really sad. On May 15th, police say James Oakley broke into the shop by breaking the window with a brick as Rose was wrapping up for the day. I said, it's closing time. You have any clothes to pick up? No, I do not have any clothes. I I'm God, I come to kill you. Police say Oakley attacked Rose, beating her with a brick, cane, and sewing machine. All of this less than a month after Rose's 89th birthday. I was down here, he run, put his hands together, pushed me back up under this machine over here. I mean, hard. Now you will die, he says. Now you will die. I'm going to sit here and watch you. Rose survived the attack, and Oakley was arrested shortly after. She has trouble walking now, but she's hoping to make a full recovery soon. And I think I'll be okay, maybe, maybe, if I get to where I can walk and do what I want to. Today, Rose and her family are cleaning out the shop for the last time. The one thing she'll miss the most is the people. She isn't sure what's next for her, but there is one thing she is sure of. I'm a pretty tough old lady. <laughs> Now, Oakley was charged with second-degree attempted murder, aggravated assault, and criminal damage. Reporting in Yuma, Zachary Moran Norris.